with Ken Drake. Vermont men's basketball has been doing what they can do to get through this season and this homestand. While they have not gotten much healthier, they have been winning as of late, a trend they were hoping to have continue. Vermont was hosting Brown as they concluded their three-game homestand on Tuesday night. Second half, Brown up by three. The dunk here is obviously going to increase that to a five-point cushion for the other guys. That may have woken up T.J. Hurley, who had a very quiet 0 for 5 in the first half, gets his first points of the game, although he would not score again. Sean Blake would do a bulk of the scoring. Another good game off the bench for him, scoring a team-high 13 points to help the cause. That would also spark a turnover in favor of the Catamounts with the turnover leading the Shamir Bogues back the other way, getting up for the finish. And yet, those baskets still would not be enough. Vermont couldn't put enough points together down the stretch, giving them their first loss at home this season. I mean, it's, it's just, you know, a couple of those where we got switched uh, and, and their big kid was being boxed out by one of our guards. But, um, you know... I'm not sure. I mean, it's obviously been a point of emphasis. We've been a top 10 rebounding team, defensive rebounding team in the country for most, if not all, of my uh, tenure here. And, and, and clearly this year, that's not the case. Yeah, I think, um, you know, we've had a few injuries to, to big guys. But I think, once again, the, the main thing is just to be ready. Um, obviously, we're all fighting for minutes. But um, at the end of the day, um, I think we kind of want what's best for the team, and that's to win uh, at the end of the day. Um, it's about us winning and this program succeeding, so uh, I think being ready at all times uh, is just our team mentality. Vermont now heads on the road with two more Ivy League games versus Yale this coming Saturday, followed by Colgate.